welcome back y'all um, today we're gonna do a little hair tutorial and I was gonna do makeup too but today is a special day we're celebrating mine and my dad's birthday today so figured I'd just do hair um, well I've already sat uh, sat it and I've already said it as you can see, all I did was just use a little spray water bottle and go pick them up at the dollar place. Um, also something that you could uh, definitely, you know, put in your backpack. So, um, we're going to do some hair today. I'm going to show you maybe two different ways. Um, I mean, it is pretty hot. I'm probably going to do an updo just to stick to the whole theme too. So, um... Got me some hairspray, uh, got me my brush, and I got a teasing comb, which you don't have to have. Uh, once again, I don't know what we're doing today. Oh, and I also have a little compact mirror. So we got that here today too. So we're trying to be a little realistic here with the whole theme of this. Make sure you wipe your mirror off if it's kind of dirty. Um, and blind yourself with the light. All right, so. What we're gonna do to here and we're just gonna use the bobby pins we got in our head because once again realistically if you did not have any more bobby pins and you're out doing whatever then yeah definitely gonna want to use the ones in your hair already assuming that you've already set your hair so this is gonna be fun never had a, this small of a mirror but we're gonna do it all right, so we're gonna take our hair down. Oh, look at that. And, uh, you know, just uh, let it, try not to rip it out. You don't wanna rip the whole daggone curl out, so. And I really don't have a rhyme or reason to my hair ever, even if I wasn't, even if it was like a situation, I would not have a rhyme or reason. I usually put like three or four in the back and then I do some on the side, so I don't even count. I don't even, I really don't think that you need to have your hair set in a particular way. In my opinion, I've been doing my hair for at least 11 years now, so, yeah. Of course, sometimes we got little doodads like that. Uh, yeah, I don't use any kind of setting lotion or anything, even when I do, you know, a heated set, which, that's not the point of this, but I'm just saying I don't use anything like that either, so... Very simple vintage gal, if you will. <laughs> but next time I'll definitely do a makeup video. I also didn't want this video to be 900 years long because I see there's a pattern with my uh, videos getting a little long there, but I do like to talk now. All right. And we're going to leave our bangs in if you have bangs. Oop. That one. So that's probably like, what would we say? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13 bobby pins. Which you can easily do a cute little Betty Grable style with. So, voila. Looking a little bit like Shirley Temple. Alright, now what we're going to do, let's see if I can put this up a little bit, this mirror, there we go. Oh, forgot another one. Lord, I ain't even paying attention today. Alright. Now. What we're wanting to do, we're going to start with a little half of a ponytail looking thing here we're gonna well maybe not 
depends on if your curls want to work with you real high up we're gonna brush i probably look crazy right now but uh trying to see in this little bitty mirror so Once you get it to a little part you like, which I'd say that's about right, you're going to twist it a little bit, and you're going to anchor her down. I don't know if you can see that, and I apologize if you can't, but it's pretty simple. It's a very simple hairstyle. I'm sure that YouTube is full of these, but mine is different somehow. <laughs> Oh, hello, blue tail scorpion. How are you today? Well, geez, don't have to run into me. These bugs ain't got no manners today, I'm telling you. Okay, might want to secure that a little more. I got pretty thick hair, even with all the bleach I've used out throughout the years. Put you one in the middle. Watch them. I'm just going to have a nice bug accessory. Don't worry. <laughs> All right. Now we're going to take the rest. Or you can leave it like that. That'd be cute too. You're half up, half down. I mean, I do this style sometimes. But it's just a little too hot today. So, I'm going to take the rest of it. Help it look nice and smooth. <laughs> but you don't need it to look too perfect unless you don't want to use a bandana then you might want to take a little, spend a little more time on it arrange them curls just so like that twist it a teeny tiny bit anchor down on the sides here Forget the one in the middle now. Now the other side. Okay. There's that. Honestly, that's probably about the most perfect my hair has ever looked in my life and just doing that and I'm Not even really using the mirror that much because I can barely see Well, I think it looks all right, and, you know and just kind of fiddle with the curls a little bit I'm gonna stick another one right here just because Anchor it down in the front a little bit, too. Do the shake test. Don't see your curls bouncing around. Perfect. Guess what you do? Spray the fire out of it. All right. Oh, and I didn't forget about the bangs now. My bangs are already teased. Honestly, that's perfect. But if you... <laughs> wow. Good job, hair. Wow. Awesome. Well, let's clean it up a little bit. But, I mean, you could do whatever you wanted here. You could leave it in a you know a little front curl or you could leave it like that and maybe pin it or you could you know have it down here i personally like mine big like a little ice cream swirl like you get at mcdonald's those little soft serves so we're gonna keep the little curl like this take you a bobby pin i don't even know why i brought a teasing comb out here but okay that was pointless and yeah you can see it because i have blonde hair but we're just gonna fiddle with it a little more spray it and spray your eyeballs just make sure that you can't see for at least 10 minutes all right let's see how that looks how to do oh pretty good see a little bump over here but 
all in all, there you go. And I know I said, you know, not to really wear bright colors and stuff like that, but today is a little bit different because, like I said, it's a special day. So I'm probably going to wear flowers in it like this or like this. But brought me out a bandana just to show you. So here's our bandana. It's already in a nice triangle. We're gonna flip it over once. So it should, 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 should look like this. Then you're gonna flip it over again. Oh, this one's got blue hair dye, perfect. Anyways, it should look like that when you're done. Tuck in the little tail there. And put it on the back there. Oh, I lost my mirror, but uh, just take it can't see huh. there we go take it on like that and tight there again y'all like my bug accessory running around flying around I mean oh Frankie's upside down and I know I said in the last video about not wearing dangly earrings but once again And if you wanted to, you could even pinch this in the back and make it a little tighter. I don't know if you can see that, but take your bobby pin, stick it in there. Oh, well, if I can get it to hold on to it. Let's try that again. There we go. Give it one more good spray. I mean, if, if you had time to do that, then you spray it. All right, guys, and there you go. Voila. There's your masterpiece, and there's your good old, pretty quick, real-time way on how to do vintage hair. That's not in your face, so if you're running or walking, you're not going to get too sweaty, so... Um, hope you guys enjoyed that and y'all need any, have any questions or anything, then just comment below or something. <laughs> Anyways, we'll holler at you later. Have a good one.